Mr. Unlucky's back. Sign is really, really faded there, and it, it looked like a kind of a, you know, it was a suburban street, so. The faded sign argument didn't work. Oh, look, yeah. <laughs> I mean, he, he. Just look forward to, because you've got such a bad run, just imagine how good the good run's going to be. That's all you can do. So you reckon that it'll, that, that there has to be a doesn't moment where I it starts think, going though. It doesn't up. matter what I think, it's what you think. Oh, look, at this stage, I'd, you know, it doesn't <laughs> matter. You know, so there you are. Wait a minute. Situation What's happening to Andrew's car? Did I leave my keys? No, uh, mate, I have a look. I don't know, sugar, do I leave my keys in my car? Sorry? I'm, I'm Is that just your car? Tired. Yeah. Andrew runs to save his car from the chop shop. For sure, I'm, 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 I know they have. They, they have. Luckily, the police turn up right outside the window. Georgie's got a front row seat to see the policeman and the ladder. Keep your eye on the ladder. As soon as he said, where are my keys, I looked over and there was a guy with a beanie about to I didn't see him. There have been a lot of carjackings lately in Sydney. Oh, shit. How did he know the keys? Did he just see the keys in the car? Everyone knows it's bad luck to walk under ladders. Georgie can't help it any longer. She's got to laugh, but at least she turns away in case Andrew walks in. But the act continues outside. What have you done? <laughs> <laughs> is it paint or is it? No, it's, paint. it's water based paint. Something. He's not happy. At least I want to sit down. Yeah, sure. Mate, look, you should really get your manager out here now, mate, because I really want to speak to someone, OK? OK. Not a problem. You all right? Is it paint? I don't know what it is. It's, it's some sort of acrylic paint or something. I don't know. Oh. Andrew, did, did you get a look at the guy? Oh, no. I mean, it's got, it's got tinted windows. I'm sorry. I'm just going to have a drink. You, you, you need mind. a drink. So what are the cops doing? Well, he's running after the guy. I mean, I don't know. It's, it's... Yeah. Were the cops in a car? Hopefully the police will be able to get him. I mean, look, I'm pretty sure. I'll catch him. What Think, was he positively. Doing? Think positively. Think positively. Georgie moves her valuables can away just in case. Or something? Think positively. They'll, they'll, they'll catch him. I'm so sorry. What's happened? Chair's broken. I'm so sorry. Leg's broken. Let's just take a seat. We'll sort this out. Yeah, yeah look, mate, don't, don't worry about it. Don't just worry about it. Just give me Bill's jacket. I'll just... It's, uh, it's, it's, give me that. So Bill's so so jacket. <laughs> Jeez, I've got this covered. Oh, jeez. I need to calm down. I, I think it's time to think about something positive. Right? Yeah. It'll be OK. Yeah. yeah. It'll be... No, mate, your look, car no, look, will be it, found. It's OK. It's just it's been wrong. a comedy of errors. I mean, I've had worse days. <laughs> <laughs> worse days? Oh, yeah. No, I'm Keep drinking your beer until you need it. I'm really sorry, Georgie. I'm, I'm so I'm sorry, you guys. Andrew, we're not I don't know. Why? What? This is ridiculous. Andy, our apartment is on fire, mate. Of course, his apartment's on fire. But wait, there's more. We've got to kill. This is like a movie. <laughs> Guy, you know, that's the guy. That's the, you, you're absolutely. That's the bloody guy. Where's my car, mate? What are you talking about? I don't have the car, mate. Mate, I saw you in the car. I saw you take my car. Well, where is it then? Where's the car? Well, I don't know, mate. Where have you stashed it? I haven't got the car. You, what are you going to do? Arrest hey, me? Georgie, for some air. Georgie, did you? Did you? You saw this guy, didn't you? Um. Mate, are you going to? Yeah. Did you, did you see this? What'd you see? What'd you see? 
I'm not sure who it was. When you said, I don't know where my keys are, I didn't know where it was. So I didn't either. say nothing, mate. You can't say that stuff. Matt, if you are serious, man. I'm Matt Tilly, Georgie. I know. Ford. As soon as you walked in, I looked over and I didn't know what you were doing. Welcome. Surprise, surprise, guys. <laughs> Georgie, I'm going to ask you a question and you have to give a true answer. You, d you did recognise me and you said through your head, you went, oh, Matt Tilly's flown such hard times, he's still in cars. <laughs> no, <laughs> did you think well, that? I looked over and, I mean, by this stage I'm thinking, what is going on? But, and I saw you come in and I, I knew who... I mean, when I first saw the beanie come in, I really did think the cops had grabbed the guy. I thought, the cops are bringing the guy in. I don't want to get involved in this. Yeah. And then I saw you and, of course, I knew who you were and I'm like, that's Matt Tilly, that's... Oh my god, this must be a gotcha call. And I still didn't get that it was me. I was still so stupid that I was thinking, they must be setting up Andrew. I still did not get it. I was just completely hook, line, and sinker. You got me full right time. to the very end, right didn't we? End. Unreal. That's our job done, Jack. I know. Done it with Georgie. And don't feel silly. Everyone is in the same boat. At the end, they see, oh, of course, how did I not see it was a setup? But you fell for it. That's what we wanted to happen. Thank you very much, Georgie Quell.